Thanks for watching. We appreciate you. Please, please subscribe. who just married the love of her life will now have to bury him. He died one hour after they said their vows. KETV Newswatch 7 Sarah Philly talk with the couple's close friend. Sarah. Monday was an important day for the Davises, Juneteenth, but also Johnny May's grandmother's birthday. Friends say the couple was looking forward to the day after two recent losses in Johnny May's life, including her father. No one could have imagined how their day would end. We were in the church and it was a beautiful ceremony. Just married, Therese and Johnny Mae Davis. It was the happiest day of Therese's life. After Monday's ceremony, the couple popped outside to take photos. Their celebration would turn to chaos. His heart stopped for the first time at 435, just an hour after the ceremony had begun. Johnny Mae Davis would be a bride and a widow within an hour. Therese suffered from a medical event that was not survivable. Therese Davis, just 48 years old, suffered a fatal blood clot. In a second, it happened within a second. The couple's children, their parents, family, and their friends all in attendance, now trying to help Johnny May cope with losing the love of her life. Johnny May has suffered through so much, and she's just such a loving person. Davis is a director at Eco Supportive Living, organizing events and helping the elderly and those with disabilities live a normal life. I just really want the community and, and all of us to just support her in the same way that she's she does on a daily basis. Her friends say she goes above and beyond daily as a caretaker for others. Now they're hoping the community can take care of her. She's been widowed and married in a 10 minute span. She's going to need lawn services. She's going to need snow removal when the winter comes. Through a GoFundMe, a meal train, and a donation collection at Eco Supportive Living off 86th and Blondo, they're looking to surround their friend with love. We really want her to just rest and we want to be able to take care of her and let her relax and nurture her children and herself. They hope this serves as a reminder to take your health seriously and advocate for care if something feels off every second minute um, take take life seriously you know try to keep your health together so you can have more happy times and your life won't get cut short like this right now on ketv.com there's a fund for johnny may and her family's six children as well as a link to the meal train and several other options to help the family back to you Thanks for watching. We appreciate you. Please, please subscribe.